Louise Madzia. I'm a ceramics designer and maker and I'm based in Camden in London. Yeah, so I design sort of illustrated pots that are made in, I get some stuff slip cast in Stoke-on-Trent in the UK. And then I also hand make and hand paint some pieces as well. So my studio's really near, it's unusual, it's owned by Camden Council, it's right around the corner from Camden Town Station. When I was at home at the beginning, I sort of wasn't as busy, sort of a quiet period, but at that point I was just painting, just doing sketches, and sort of thinking about what I wanted to make when I was back in the studio. The situation has affected me because um, I feel I feel more and more grateful for the position I'm in, that I have a studio and workspace that's separate from home, and I feel lucky I'm still in business, I'm still busy. So it's hard sometimes, but it, it just really helps having a, a separate space and keeping my work separate. So I just feel more and more grateful for that this time. My advice would be to not be hard on yourself, just be kind to yourself. And when I am feeling like uninspired, it's really good to look at other artists and lots of older work. Not just to reference it, but just to get you inspired to make work, even if your work's completely different. I think just giving yourself time and space and not having to like create stuff every day, just being like gentle with yourself and because sometimes like just because you're working every day doesn't mean you're really like producing anything if you're not feeling good or if you're feeling low, like it's good to sort of think about what you want in the moment, I don't know. Sort of cheesy.